Frank in Home Cook. So today I'm going to take you guys to Peru. Not physically, but through food. Today we're going to make something Peruvians are known for. It's the ceviche. We're going to give it a spin. We're going to combine it with another ceviche that I really, really like. The Kinilaw Sagata na mga Bisaya. Or ceviche in coconut milk. So for this vlog, we're going to make a Filipino Peruvian ceviche. Let's go! Alright, so we're going to use a tuna for our ceviche. We have here a very beautiful pink tuna. It's 410 grams of tuna. We're going to dice it. Alright, so ito na yung tuna natin. Let's grab a bowl. Next thing we'll do natin, lalagyan natin siya ng mint. Heavier mint. Fresh mint. And then some basil. It's so rustic yung gagawin natin dito. Hindi natin siya kakat masyado. This is Thai basil. Right. Then ilalagay natin siya dito sa ating ceviche. Next, we need lemon. save natin for later. And then I have lime. I like to use different citrus in the fruits here. We need chili. Why not? I think it's not strip. We need vinegar for this. We're going to use Dato Kuti um, Pinoy spice. Na toba. Toba vinegar. Or coconut vinegar. Ilagay natin yung suka, magre-react na agad siya sa tuna. So as you can see, nagiging white siya. So, we're gonna mix this. Ang very and then we will set this aside for 5 minutes. Alright, so next, gagawa tayo ng sauce natin for that ceviche. We need coconut milk. This is 200 grams coconut milk. We have onions. Very close. We need 
lemon juice. We have lime, yung half ng lime na ginamit natin kanina. We have some ginger. Ganito lang siya kalaki. A little bit of salt. And basil. This is Thai baked basil. That's it. The spin. Let's give it a taste. I need more salt. Okay, it's ready. So, lalabas na natin ating ceviche. We're going to put some of this. Okay, now let's give it a taste. From here, you can be creative. You can add in fruit. In Peru, they add sweet corn and sweet potato. Uh, I'm not going to add a sweet potato, but I'm going to add a corn. I'm going to add several fruits and then serve it with milk. Okay, let's go. All right, so ito na yung ceviche natin. I'm going to add in pomelo. So ito na siya. Ni may ko lang. I'm going to add pickled mangoes. Green mangoes na pickled. Kung wala kayo, green mango would work. Just as fine, but we're going to add green mangoes in. And then dragon fruit. So, ito yung dragon fruit. Kalhati yung dinamit ko. I'm going to add dragon fruit here. Dinice ko lang siya. And lastly, I'm going to add corn, kernel, whole kernel corn in brine. So, mga three spoons to. Mga three spoons. Alright, I'm just going to add in. One more chili. We just took a Let's make it two. And onions. All right. So let's mix. Alright, so there you have it, our Filipino Peruvian ceviche. Let's plate. Alright, so I'm going to plate it here. I'm gonna start off with the sauce, ceviche sauce. And get that. And then the ceviche. And then we're going to add mint on top. Alright, so there you have it. I think Filipino Peruvian ceviche. So let's taste this bad boy. Mm. Mm. Wow, there's like a thousand flavors there. Okay. Pinaka gusto ko dito yung freshness ng mga fruits na nilagyan natin. Pomelo is exploding in your mouth. It's like tiny bits of citrusy na flavor na sumasabog sa bibig. The sauce, ceviche, there's a lot in there. There's garlic, there's onion, there's there's a lot of flavor, but they're working together really, really well in your mouth. There's one thing that I would like to change. Probably, mas nadagdagan ko pa yung sili. 
I hope you enjoyed making ceviche with me today. Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's Carla Tiope. Like, share this video. And don't forget to click the notification button. And follow me on Instagram at the Quarantine Hope Cook. And on Facebook, it's facebook.com slash the Quarantine Hope Cook. That's it for today, guys. Thank you so much. See you next time. Adios.